Again, uh, the governor spoke. The oldest known time capsule in America, buried on the 20th anniversary of the Declaration of Independence and containing objects placed there by, among others, Paul Revere and founding father Samuel Adams, has been opened. Now I'm excited. Boston's Museum of Fine Arts took on the responsibility for the grand opening and will now spend time and money on examining the contents, which include additional objects placed in the box in the 19th century. So now we will uh, document them properly. We will write detailed reports. We will uh, photograph them um, and we will examine them with a variety of means uh, to determine their materials and determine the kinds of corrosion that are uh, that's on the metal. Just taking the lid off the lead box needed half a day, but curators will spend much longer than that on analysing its contents. Until now, the box has been part of a cornerstone in Boston's State House, but it's not known if it will be returned there once curators have finished or if modern objects will be added, like once in 1855. It'll all be through this process. Sure.